Hey y'all, let's talk about consonants, specifically end consonants, and how they can get in the way of your sound and manipulate the pitch so that it sounds like it's off when it's not. Let's start with the R's. Here are some examples of some words that are used commonly when writing lyrics. First, let's start off by just saying some of these. Fear, fire, lover, girl, world, heart, dark, aardvark. Now let's say them together and focus specifically on the way it feels when we actually say the word. Notice how the word is being either pulled back to the back of the throat, how you're leaning on the R's, how closed off the word might feel in order to say it. Let's say these together, starting from the top. Fear, fire, lover, girl, world, heart, dark, aardvark. Now, let's say them together, and as we say them together, I want you to watch how my mouth forms the words to be able to speak them. Fear, fire, lover, girl, world, heart, dark, aardvark. With an influenced Midwest accent, I use the R as a vowel. R is not a vowel. Fear, fire, dark, girl. Now we're going to try this again and we're going to try not to say any of the R's. We're going to challenge our mind, our brains of what we know, what we were taught, and tell our brain that we're in control of how we want that vowel to sound how we want that R to be non-existent or existent but subtle. So we're gonna take the R's out and try not to say them at all. Okay, let's see if we can read these together. Fia, fire, lover, gull, world, hot, dark, aardvark, fear, fire, Lover, girl, world, heart, dark, aardvark. That's the space we need in order to sing these words. For example, this girl is on fire. It's going to get stuck here. This girl is on fire. My girl versus my girl. You're a heartbreaker. You're a heartbreaker. Heartbreaker. Go to the extreme first. It's always easy to take a little bit away than it is to try to give more when you've never practiced giving that much to begin with. Try taking the R's out of some of those words and it might open up your sound a little bit. Turn the R's into more of an ah or an uh. Focus on singing through the vowel and not singing through the consonant. More consonant videos to come. Next up, we're going to go for the LD, LK, LING, and ING to show you how those can also get in the way of producing the best sound that's inside of you.